the Senate's ad hoc committee charged the was summoned. The president president charged the ad hoc committee to summon the leadership of NDLEA to appear before the Senate to justify the allegations. Still on the Senate. A bill for one acts to establish National Food Reserve Agency has scaled through second reading. The bill was sponsored by Senator Salihu Mustafa of APC Quara Central. In his lead debate, Senator Salihu Mustafa said the bill, when passed into law, would provide a legal framework on the country's National Food or Grains Reserve Agency to function better than the way it was at the time. President, distinguished colleagues, the bill seeks to further develop the agricultural sector by ensuring national food security and income through marketing and storage services, as well as addressing emergency food crisis. Mr. President, distinguished colleagues, the bill will also establish the National Food Reserve Agency for the purpose of implementing the National Food Reserve Policy reducing post-harvest losses and providing food security for the nation. Many senators were seen supporting the bill and it was passed for third reading. The need for having food reserve for the country. A country of over 200 million people cannot have self-sufficiency and food security without food reserve. And for that reason, the federal government saw it right and it's established the agency. We even have the agency in existence. Our well, president, distinguished senators, this agency, when established, is not only going to work by way of price stabilization, because the agency will be charged with the responsibility of buying up surplus with a view to storing it during the period of a harvest. And if there is scarcity, the agency will now bring it out and sell it to the members of the public by way of subsidized price. Senator Salisu Mustafa, in an interview, said the bill would concentrate more on legal framework. He said the law will make government increase food preservation by buying grains from local farmers for the agency to preserve. Senator Mustafa said Nigeria relies more on local farmers who primarily farm for feeding and take a little to the market to sell to solve their daily challenges.